Hello friends, welcome to the Cold War Prepper. My name is Lee. I, I want to share something with you today. Um, I'm actually going to go start putting this stuff together for the uh, uh, meals uh, that I talked about in my last video. I'm going to do breakfast number one and then meals number one and two. And, and the reason I'm calling it meals number one and two is, is what I learned a long time ago is lunch and dinner can almost be interchangeable. Well, you can interchange in almost any of them. There are some that are more breakfast than others, but uh, uh, and I'm going to get those cans and, and products and everything together to kind of show you what one day would look like. Uh, but I came, you know, in my, in my thoughts this morning, uh, one of the readings was uh, the saint of the day. And today is the feast day of St. Lawrence of Rome. And so I just kind of want to share you a, a very unique story. And uh, I love this guy. And uh, maybe uh, you'll find some, some, uh, something out of it. You'll get something out of it. So, St. Lawrence of Rome, the saint of the day. St. Lawrence of Rome died uh, August 10th, 258 AD, was most likely a Spaniard by birth who lived in Rome while uh, Christianity was outlawed under the pain of death. He was appointed by Pope St. Sixtus II as the archdeacon over the seven deacons of Rome and held the sacred duty of, of tending to the church's wealth and distributing alms to the poor. After Pope St. Sixtus II was beheaded by Roman Emperor Valerian, along with the other six deacons, Lawrence was left as the highest ranking clergy in Rome, and he was ordered by the Roman authorities to appear before the tribunal, a summons basically for his execution, along with the treasures of the church that were in his possession. So St. Lawrence then quickly distributed the church's wealth to the poor so that the government could not confiscate it. And on the appointed day, August 10th, St. Lawrence responded to the summons by bringing with him a multitude of the poor and crippled of Rome, and these, he proclaimed, were the true treasures of the church. Uh, this angered the authorities so greatly that Lawrence was ordered to be burned alive on a gridiron. He was bound to the metal grate and slowly roasted to death over hot coals. During his torture, Lawrence famously mocked his torturers by saying, I'm done on this side, turn me over. St. Lawrence is the patron saint of many causes, including cooks, chefs, comedians, deacons, librarians, students, and the poor. And today we celebrate his feast day. So remember, we're all in this together, so we can come out the other side together. Togetherness is the key. Take care. Bye-bye.